Hello YouTube, it is I, Banded Wendy. How are you? I thought I'd come in and do a little recap of the WLSFA 2016 meet and greet in Nashville uh, with my cowboy hat. <laughs> uh, what a great event. So it was last weekend in Nashville, uh, Friday the 14th, uh, I guess it was Friday the 13th. Yes, and then the 14th Saturday and the 15th Sunday. And I got a bunch of stuff here to share uh, that I, as I was unpacking, I, I ran into. Uh, I just have to say that uh, Monica was the first person I got to greet uh, when I got there. And uh, old school YouTuber, so it was perfect for me to run into her at first. Uh, she's a piece of my heart, piece of my weight loss surgery journey for sure. And then we got a chance to go down uh, town, uh, Broadway, I think is the name of the street in Nashville. And the Millers were there and Jody Olds was there uh, and Monica and myself and just had a great time reconnecting with old friends. So that really set the tone uh, for the balance of the weekend. The event started on Friday and I was an exhibitor, so WLS Success Matters was there exhibiting. It's just so great to see all the exhibitors there uh, showcasing their products, introducing patients to new and improved uh, products and services that a patient more than likely is going to need. Uh, Molly, high five on working all those exhibitors and making everybody happy. Uh, and there was a full day of various different speakers and topics that I personally did not get to attend, but everybody was flowing in and out of those and uh, having, I could, you could hear the laughter and you could see the love and you could feel the joy and the energy of everybody that was attending the event and going to all these inspiring and motivational talks uh, that, was hap that happened on Friday. Uh, so many people that I got to see. Uh, I did a talk on Friday, which maybe I'll come back here and do a video about social media. And uh, the highlight was that uh, there were tears, tears in a talk about social media. And I asked somebody, what did you take away? And they said, what are you taking away from the chat? And she said, family. Uh, so that was really cool to have a part of that and share my personal social media experience with others. Uh, Friday night was the uh, the country night. So much fun. Uh, seeing everyone decked out in their country gear. The waffles, uh, Sarah and Chris, did a fantastic job. Really, really, really good job as the MCs, both Friday and Saturday night. Uh, I think everybody had a lot of fun with that. Um, pictures were fun. Uh, Aaron Miller, everywhere you go, he's got his camera highlighting, you know, capturing all the highlights of the of the weekend. Um, the Saturday we started out bright and early, 7 a.m. with a 5K, and so there was medals. How cool is that? Way to go, WSFA! And there were T-shirts, right? How cool is that? Uh, oh, and let's not forget, I believe it was Friday night, yeah, which was Late Night with Carney Wilson and her husband Rob, and there were these cool hats with that, uh, and Carney is such a joy uh, whenever you see her, and it's funny, and her husband was uh, charming, and they made uh, great music together, so that was a first for the WSFA, and just the fact that for Rob to be there with Carney and for Carney to perform uh, with her husband at that. So it even says here with uh, Carney and Rob. So that was a lot of fun on Friday night. Uh, the 5K Saturday morning, uh, seeing uh, all the people that were out there early to get their move on before the day started. And uh, Saturday was another day of me working in the booth, but more uh, great conversations and meeting and greeting and people uh, getting some value out of the presentations and the talks that were there. I and mean, there were so many, there was stuff about food, there was bariatric doctors speaking, there were people talking about Regain, there were a couple of panels about YouTube, um, there was some stuff about fitness. Again, I didn't get to partake in that stuff, but I heard people talking about, and I've seen the highlights that people shared from those. So certainly um, inspirational, motivational, and educational. Part, paired with a bunch of fun, right? 
Uh, Saturday night was the bling night, and uh, it was so cool to see everyone dressed up in their bling. And the the two guys, I don't know their names, but they have always just go all out with their outfits. And they uh, were Lisa Marie, I believe, and uh, Elvis, which was so fitting uh, for Nashville. And they won the male bling off together as a pair. And then uh, Tanya, uh, VSG Tanya, I think it is, uh, or Tanya VSG, uh, had the coolest, I thought, I, I was calling it a jumpsuit, but it's actually a romper, blinged out romper and won this amazing crown. And I know the bling off is a lot of fun for Tony. So, uh, Antonia, uh, so that was fun. Uh, Mr. C picked out his suit months in advance. So it was cool to uh, try to match his suit. So we had fun getting dressed up for that event. Uh, the Waffles had asked us, uh, Craig and I, Mr. C and I, to play um, Family Feud, weight loss surgery style. And our team, uh, James Haney was on there, Sarah Spano was on there, uh, Lauren Dayton, I want to say. I, I don't know everybody's names, um, but a bunch of fabulous, amazing people. Our team won, so we got these cool Bluetooth speakers, right? So that was fun on Saturday night. Uh, Apollo was there, uh, a big sponsor, and uh, I'm, I'm close uh, friends with uh, the two fellows that were there, and so it was fun to, uh, to share time with them and hear what their thoughts were about the event and how touched they were by all these patients coming together in the space and celebrating their journeys. Uh, Sunday, we got to wake up and win again with the another 5K, and it was great to see repeaters out there from the day before. There was a woman who uh, had knee surgery. She was 68 years old, and it was her first 5K ever. So we had walkers, we had runners, we had walk runners. It was a dream come true for me, uh, Jean Screen Journey. I got to run with her, and she brought that thing home uh, coming in first, and I, I came in right behind her. So I've known Jean for a long time, and uh, it was fun to get out there uh, with, a, with an old friend like that to do a first together. Uh, and Sunday, then it was all about the quiche, right? There was raffle prizes and the quiche send-off and then Chopped, which I think is probably the coolest new add-on to the whole meet and greet. It started last year. Carney Wilson is there. You know, she's been on the show Chopped. And so we have a WSFA uh, Chopped thing that goes on. And there were three different contestants, and you had Mama Rose and uh, VSG Kirk, along with Carney, um, judging the competition. And there was a winner, a gal from New Jersey, and uh, it was just a lot of fun to, to see that go on because we got to eat, right? So uh, no pressure for the contestants, but I, I certainly love the Chopped event. Uh, and then it was like, oh, we have to go. It's over already. So, you know, the big, big takeaways are that it's always about the people. Uh, I, the WSFA continues to uh, deliver and improve the quality of the event uh, via the speakers, via the decorations, via the food, uh, via the marketing, uh, the brochures and and pamphlets and things that were handed out at the event were just lovely. Uh, the camaraderie and the friendships and the connections that people make, uh, even if you're not a part of them, but you just simply get to sit back and watch them, uh, it, it certainly makes your heart glow. Uh, all the, the old, old folks that I got to see that I love so much, uh, and all the ones I missed. I missed uh, so many of my old friends, so they announced the 2017 meet and greet portland oregon that means up here in the pacific northwest just down the road a bit from me and so i am here to say to all my class of 2009 show up you got a year i think it's march 19th through the 21st i'm sorry may 19th through the 21st and that's what was missing for me that that was the biggest piece there are a few of you there but uh, that class of 2009, uh, those of, you know, 2010, where are you? Uh, what, what, what do you say about showing up in, in 2017 at the WSFA meet and greet in Portland? I think it's time. Uh, that would be so cool. Uh, I, I consider you guys family and old school. And my heart yearned for you at this event. Um, so with that said, thank you WSFA, thanks to all the board members, thanks to all the volunteers, 
Uh, the volunteers got really cool shirts this year. Uh, I love that. Uh, thanks to all the sponsors and everybody who chose to spend their weekend and their time and their finances to be there to support um, more grants. WSFA is up to 21 grants that are fully, truly funded by this community and the people who come to the meet and greet. So I just wanted to say I loved it. It was great. Uh, I think uh, I've missed it already and I wish we were doing it again this weekend. But I certainly look forward to uh, the next event and uh, we'll see you there in Portland, right? WLSFA.org. Go there, find out more information. They're on Facebook. If you want to check out pictures on the net, you can use the hashtag uh, WSFA 2016 and there's photos and there's videos and uh, you know hundreds of people snapping and sharing so if you want to go see more about it uh, in, in photo format in video format you can all right bye